Hey there, my name is Tracy from Randomness of Rudy. Welcome to the Scorpio Experience. In this series of videos, we're going to take a look at Scorpio and a relationship with each sign of the zodiac. But before we dive into compatibility, let's take a look at Scorpio and a relationship in general. Scorpios are born October 23rd through November 22nd. And next to Aquarius, Scorpio is by far the most misunderstood sign of the zodiac. Scorpios are known to be these intense characters. And, and the fact of the matter is they are. Scorpio is a water sign. And so what Water signs in general tend to be very emotional, very intuitive, and very sensitive. And so water signs, which are Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio, will be able to pick up on very subtle energy more poignantly than any other sign of the zodiac of a different element. And so if anything, you could say all water signs are intense, um, but Scorpio is special. The saying still waters run deep was uh, meant for a Scorpio, and, and this really describes their character. You know, this is an energy that can be quite pleasant um, and, and amenable and, and very just nice in general. Um, but most people don't know what goes on beneath the surface. And, and what goes on beneath the surface of a Scorpio is a lot, okay? This is an energy ruled by the planet Pluto. And so Pluto in astrology is very much concerned with transformation. This is an energy that really enjoys plunging beneath the surface of any person, situation, or event for the sake of unveiling whatever's toxic, whatever's hidden, whatever doesn't belong uh, in order to essentially be reborn and, and to embody the image of the phoenix rising from the ashes. That is Scorpio on a, in a nutshell. Um, and, and basically, this means that Scorpio enjoys intense experiences. Scorpio needs depth. Scorpio needs emotional directness and, and Scorpio needs to really kind of investigate the minutia of, of anything, whether it's a relationship or a job, okay? That's why Scorpios are known to be the detective of the Zodiac. They're always trying to get to the bottom of something. And if they're not spending the time figuring it out on their own in terms of how they are feeling themselves, then most likely they are spending the time investigating you. And this is something that you need to be aware of going into a relationship with a Scorpio. They don't mean to be manipulative. They don't mean any kind of mal intent. Um, they just want to know you and they just want to know that they can trust you. And they want to know that as they go through these experiences of transformation, that you'll be there with them. Okay, whether you're going through it as well or whether you're content with waiting for them to go through it on their own, all right? And so this is something that's very important to a Scorpio. And when you're entering into a relationship with a Scorpio, know that as they grow and evolve and transform, so will you. And so this isn't a relationship for the faint of heart, and you want to be mindful of this, okay? Scorpio requires a partner that is strong in his or her own right. Scorpio requires a, partment, a, a partner that is able to commit and is loyal and is in predictable and, and reliable and dependable. But most importantly, Scorpio requires a partner that is willing to merge with them on deep levels, okay? And so if this is not something that you're comfortable with, if you don't like the idea of being made to feel completely vulnerable as a result of your interaction with a Scorpio, then this is not a relationship for you. And, and this isn't to say that these things are bad about Scorpio. It is what it is. It's how they operate. This is a sign that is very much concerned with transforming itself for the better. This is a sign that is constantly evolving, constantly being reborn through different scenarios and situations and experiences. And this is a sign that lives life to the fullest. This is a sign that dives in. And if you are not willing or able to do that with a Scorpio in a relationship, 
then this is going to be a difficult match for you, okay? But note this up front about Scorpio, so there's no misunderstanding here. When it comes to sexual compatibility, Scorpios are known to be the most sexual sign of the zodiac, but keep in mind that, you know, Scorpios don't enjoy sex for sex's sake. They like the idea of that depth and connection and deep desires that come with sexual intimacy. And so know that if a Scorpio has his or her eyes on you, um, and is courting you, and you're in a relationship with a Scorpio, most likely, especially if the Scorpio cares for you and is connected to you, the sex will be just as good, okay? And finally, as far as courtship goes, Scorpios are very particular, all right? And, and they are very intuitive, and they have depth of insight. And so they can essentially see right through you. <laughs> and so know that when a Scorpio is courting you, he or she is, is courting you. He or she wants to be with you. If there's any uncertainty um, that you feel from your Scorpio, it's because your Scorpio is uncertain, okay? Scorpio is mate for life. They're not looking for anything casual. They're not looking for a fling um, unless it's an unevolved Scorpio. But uh, for the most part, Scorpios are interested in merging, Full, fully, fully so, okay? And so they will court you. Um, they will be pretty straightforward and consistent in their courtship of you. And if you feel like it's not something you're interested in, you need to be upfront with Scorpio about this from the very beginning, okay? If you're open to it, you're going to have to exercise patience with your Scorpio as he or she comes to get to know, get to know you and as he examines you and, and investigates you and, and all of the inner workings of you, okay? So keep this, as, keep this in mind as well with the Scorpio, all right? So go ahead, take a look at the other videos in this series and, and hopefully you will find them to be of benefit. And in the meantime, if you want more information on your relationship with a Scorpio, feel free to visit my website at randomnessofruity.com and schedule yourself a compatibility reading. Good luck.